Alright, so we're back again. I've got my special guest again with me this week. So I did a question thing on Instagram to see what you guys wanted to see. Does that make sense? Yeah. <laughs> to see what you guys wanted to see. Uh, you know what I'm talking about. And one of the main ones that everyone said was... Assumptions. What? Reacting yeah. to your assumptions. I did another one and asked everyone what their assumptions of Maddie and I were. There were some interesting ones coming through. So Maddie did some this morning and... Do you still have them? No. Oh, sh I deleted them. Well, the video's not going to work. <laughs> <laughs> no, but we asked... Yeah, you've got them. Yeah, I screenshotted them. So we asked everyone what their assumptions were of each of us. And yeah, I'm going to read them out because Maddie hasn't really read them yet. So yeah, I'm really you'll see the real reaction. I actually really want to know what people said. And I haven't really read them too much either. There's only a couple that I did. So, first one. No, you're not allowed to read it. Okay. <laughs> first one was you were tuning Maddie before she was single. <laughs> <laughs> no. So not right. I, I didn't even. I didn't even know. Like I knew who you were, but like I hadn't spoken to you. Yeah, we spoke about this in a video. Like, I think in a couple of videos where we said back in like May. Yeah. Maddie slid into my DMs. And we, I've got the screenshot because I kept going back and I kept using it against Maddie yeah. that she slid into my DMs. So. Um, and yeah, I was single before that, so. Yeah, and I definitely was, so. Yeah. That's definitely no. <laughs> Unlucky. Well, that person said it through six times, so they really wanted to assume that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing this one's for me, but when you. Stop reading them. <laughs> so rude. When you like slash love someone, you do anything for them. Is this for me? With a little... You? I think it's for me because it's on mine. Okay. But I feel like that's true. I feel like it's true when you like or love anyone, right? Mm hmm Oh, I feel like that's how it should be anyway. Yeah. Do I do that? Yes, you do. Correct. <laughs> you are not doing accounting anymore, by the way, I love your style. Well, yeah, that's correct. I'm not doing my accounting job anymore. I haven't for like the last two and a bit years. But that's kind of a boring one, so we'll skip that. <laughs> skip to the next. Another one is you're shorter than your height you say you are. I don't know if you're saying that to me or you. Have you oh, said I... you're tall? <laughs> <laughs> I'm five foot two. <laughs> <laughs> I am not tall. And I'm like exactly six foot. So I think it's like 182. 182.3 or something. Yeah. That's what I am. So I don't think... Uh, I've no. never said I'm like a lot taller than I... Yeah. I don't know. I feel like no. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people are actually like surprised how tall I am and actually see me. Although now I may say just five two and I look like the same height. <laughs> I was like going like this before when I sat up. Um, I just can't sit up any higher because otherwise I'll be out of the camera. But I've never said that I'm taller than six foot. Yeah, I know. I don't want to be taller than six foot. I'm happy how tall I am. <laughs> You're so much happier in this relationship. With Maddie, absolute vibe. I just feel like we're right for each other, and I feel someone's <laughs> trying to get like some controversy out of us. I'm definitely happier than I'm like the happiest I've ever been. So, if that answers your question, then yeah, but that's no shade. So, the next one is Maddie isn't your typical type or the typical type of girl you usually go for. Love her, though. Love you. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I don't have like a specific type except for like personality wise, and Maddie like definitely fits that bill. Yeah. But, yeah, I don't know. I, people always think I have a specific type. Or I, I love, like, blue eyes. Do you have that? Yeah. Blue eyes and smile is my kind of type. That's one thing that I always get. And, like, <laughs> clearly that's her. And personality for you. Yeah, personality. And her personality is exactly that fits my bill. Fits your bill. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you guys give each other the space needed to grow alone and prosper. Prosper? <laughs> That's a funny one. Funny. Uh, I don't know. But we spend yeah. so much time together. We spend yeah, we spend all the so time, time together. But I feel like we like grow together. Like I feel like we encourage each other to yeah. like, always like keep working and stuff. But a lot of the start, and even like what last week, Maddie went overseas to Fiji by herself, so I wasn't there either. Yeah. So we spent like a week apart, and then at the start we kind of spent like a week on, week off, week on kind of thing. Yeah. And um, and so we still do our own thing, but it's just the last couple of weeks since I've been back down in Sydney, like we've just been making the most of it. Yeah. And just, I don't know, it's just not, we're not like trying to spend like every single day together, but it just works out like that. It's just been perfect. Yeah. So we yeah. just have. <laughs> you should well, be nice someone to me just, and I'll just be like, 
I just started reading one and it was just like, at the start I was thinking it was a genuine question and then it was just like a genuine hate assumption. And I'm not including that because that's just stupid. Uh, next one is another stupid hate, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. And someone said, I assume you're either vain or bisexual. And I'm guessing she's asking this because I look after myself. Mm -hmm. You know, we spoke about that. Yeah. I get like all these comments and it's just honestly stupid that people always say that I'm either gay, bi or whatever. Just because I look after myself. Like I look after my skin or I don't know, I get haircuts. Yeah. Just like this, the tiniest little things. And it's like, do they live in like the 19th century? Like people do that these days. Everyone does. Like I take pride in how I look. Mm -hmm. Doesn't mean I'm like my sexuality comes anything in. Anything to do with that? Yeah, I have a girlfriend. What? <laughs> I some people are just stupid, and I just I'm not gonna respond personally to them because it's just dumb. But they can go and waste their time and follow me and say all this kind of stuff, and it's just not gonna affect me. Yeah. But yeah, there you go. I'm definitely go. not <laughs> none of those. Your yeah. assumption is completely wrong. Uh, the next one is that you're genuinely both happy. Yes, I'm so happy. So am I. Like, I'm honestly so happy. Same, I'm down in Sydney now, and like, I've wanted to move for so long, and I just felt kind of stale in Brisbane, mm. for like a lot of different reasons. Fresh start. Yeah, and I've been down here, fresh start, I've been very active, and like, getting heaps of work done, mm. and all that kind of stuff, and just, I don't think I've been happier. And so many people have been messaging me, saying that, that I've really noticed, even my good friends and stuff like that. Yeah. And I love it. Cause I am. Oh, someone's <clears throat> assumption is that we both use tan injections. No. Not at all. No. I'm like naturally this this dark. You guys know that I fake tan, so. And Maddie fakes tan, so. Yeah. If you want to see her before and after, just go and have a look <laughs> on her Instagram. LinkedIn bio. She's gonna be sending. Yeah, she's gonna be showing exactly. <clears throat> but no, I've always been this dark. Like I feel like I'm kind of like pale compared to what I'm always yeah, been as a kid pale. but so scroll pale. like the whole way through my instagram if you really want to have a look he's so tan and then go into my tag photos my mum tags me in photos from when i was a little kid and i'm just as tan or even tan a bit really yeah oh my i've just got olive skin i'm just lucky in that sense so lucky i've never used any tan injections ever so that's wrong maddie would be next level shy in person Is. Yeah, I agree with that. You know, like yeah. if I'm with all of my friends or if I'm with you, I feel like I'm comfortable and I'm super outgoing. But if I'm like in a situation where I'm like by myself, then I'm so shy. Yeah, I'm the exact same. That's super too. awkward. <laughs> yeah, I feel you. Yeah, it just depends. Yeah. Next one is that you love that each other do social media makes life so much easier. It does make life easier, for sure. Yeah, I think we spoke about this again as well in like yeah. another video, but it just makes, I don't know, just, I feel so much more motivated. Yeah. And I can always just ask Maddie, it's, this is so good, especially for a male, we can just, I can just ask Maddie for like her input and like thoughts about just anything, like if it's from deals to photos to videos, just anything. Mm -hmm. And it's always good just to get that second, wait, there's a plane. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, just get that second opinion where it just makes you so much more confident when you do stuff. And like we had a photo day. Like yeah. it's easy for us to get like photos for like brands and stuff. Like we can just like take photos together and Yeah, before I was like trying so to get funny. heaps of photos in the in the mirror and stuff like that and just you can't do that. So much harder. So it makes it definitely makes it easier having someone that's like in the same for content. Yeah. And also I feel like this especially for me, like when I do videos, I I feel not as energized and um, as good when I do videos just by myself. So even if you can be in like part of the video, yeah, you feel it's like a vlog or anything, I feel so much better and just like, I feel like it's gonna be more interesting because like I'm more bubbly and mm -hmm. energetic and you know, just myself when yeah. I'm not by myself. <laughs> so yeah, you are right, it's so right. All right, so these are the new ones from this morning now. That if I ever break up with the girlfriend that you'd like to marry me. But like, I don't even know who the hell you are. Our relationship was rushed? No, I feel like it's just because we didn't post about it for so long. Yeah, definitely. So everyone was like, whoa, like when we first posted that like photo together, everyone was freaking out. Yeah. But we actually had been seeing each other for like months. Yeah. And like talking, like yeah. nonstop for so long. Yeah. And I feel like it was borderline like about to be like official for a while. Yeah. And then we're, it like went official like at the perfect time. Yeah. 
But yeah, it definitely wasn't rushed at no. all. I don't think anything's been rushed with us. No. Um, the next one is videos are cropped because you make sneaky, dirty comments. <laughs> I don't know what? what that means, but <laughs> if you're talking about my YouTube videos, I crop it and it's like I have to edit it because I'm not a very, like, I'm not the best speaker. That's like everyone though. I feel like, that, like I can't. I have to edit my videos as well because I stutter. Yeah, but I also like I've only kind of just started this. I'm like still fairly re uh, new, and I kept saying um so much because yeah. I wasn't fully that like, comfortable. And like I say like all the time. Yeah, so I just edit my videos because like, I don't want you to sit there and have to listen to me say um or like think about the next mm -hmm. thing I was going to say or something that like interrupts or anything like that. Yeah. So. That's why I edit my videos, because I feel like you're not going to like them if I didn't edit them. Yeah. <laughs> not because I make sly little jokes. <laughs> Alright, that's all the assumptions that people have sent through. So hopefully you get to know a bit more about both of us. Yeah. And hopefully I got to clear up some of the assumptions that were made of both of us mm -hmm. in that video. Anyways, I hope you liked the video and any other video requests, put them down in the comments below. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video.